What's going on you guys? Welcome back to another My name is Jeff. Reacts. I'm gonna try to roll on this as best as I can. <laughs> try to get back on track just even a little bit. Maybe not all the way, but a little bit. Still dealing with some stuff in my head, but you know, I'll get through it one way or another and you guys are amazing. I had to do today's, obviously 100%. This is a special request. Happy birthday, Macawal. I always forget how you actually pronounce that, but Macawal94. You wanted me to do a dough, uh, you see what? I don't know exactly how to pronounce that, but I hope I got it close. You said uh, for me to try something different, there is a Ute, I don't know how to pronounce that either, a singer that doesn't show her face to the public from Japan. And she made and she made many covers from Japan, but also some original tracks. I think you should try reacting to her. So hey, happy birthday, Macawal. I hope you had the best birthday possible. I hope you had an amazing, awesome day. You deserve it, man. I could, I know I'm a little bit late. I know, I know. I'm, I'm backed up and everything, and I am sorry for that, but I do hope you still enjoy this late birthday present. Here's to you. Let's, I don't want to waste too much time. I hope you guys are all having a good day, and if not, I hope I could bring some sort of positive light to your day, because guys, whatever's going on for you, whatever it may be, just remember that you are not alone. You are never alone. You're a warrior, you're a soldier. Stay strong, I believe in you. And if you need it, the comments are there for you to vent, or you can DM me personally on my socials. But you do got this. Bro fist. I've let's do it. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna pause real quick. This is gonna be the spot. Already off to a good start, actually. I do like it. <laughs> I don't know what to drum to exactly, so my air drumming's a little slow so far. I mean, I haven't even air drummed at all. I've just had bang, but I do like it. I actually kind of like the animation for a change, like the cartoon. Like, obviously, you said she doesn't show her face, so you'll, you'll probably nobody will probably ever see her face in a music video or anybody else's. It'll probably always be stuff like this, and you'll just hear her voice, and that's fine. If you want, feel like hiding your face to each their own, I, w I honestly wouldn't blame you with fame and everything and that comes with that. It, yeah, I, I don't really blame you. Can't say anything for myself. No, I've shown my face in the millions. I've shown my face in thousands of videos, but I don't blame her. Anyways, I do like the music. Can't understand the lyrics. I'll tell you right now. I don't want to sound, you know, I'm not going to go down that road, but simple as that. I don't know the language, but... I respect it. I'm going to look it up afterwards. I do like the song, though. We're off to a really good start. The, the beat is extremely catchy, and she's got a good voice. And I do like the creativity behind the animation. I praise it. Let's keep going. <laughs> Why does this remind me of an anime I watched already? Like that's weird. I don't know why. Oh, 
Here's it, wow. I like that high pitch. Electronic beat there, that's cool. That's really catchy, that kind of gets you moving. Okay, I hate to interrupt, but I do want to get one more pause in before it's over, just in case of copyright. I'm sorry, you can be mad at me. Probably going to be like, well, dude, why'd you pause at the best part of the song? I know, I'm sorry. Get one more in there. I won't deny, the very beginning of the whole song startled me. I'm sure you guys noticed that. And yes, I'm sorry for the cough again. I'm always going to apologize for that. I feel bad. It's gross. Let's not go down that road. I'm sorry. I got a bad cough. I will be okay. I'm trying not to do it too much during the reaction. But this is really catchy. And that breakdown was actually pretty intense. I know this is going to sound so cliche, but seriously, this animation literally reminds me of a couple animes that I've watched. I'm not a huge anime watcher, and I don't want to offend you guys. I know the anime community is like, why do people keep comparing these to animes, blah, blah, blah. I'm sorry. It just, to me, it seems so similar. I'm sorry. I'll say it. But it does. I mean, I've only watched a couple, I've only watched a few animes in my time, and this looks like one of them. I said a couple of them, but it, I mean, it's kind of, yeah. just get back into it. Finish it off, Jeff. I paused it again, didn't I? I can honestly say I wasn't expecting that at all. I am at a loss for words. I have no idea even remotely what the song was about, but seriously, that whole beat and her voice was catchy as heck. I loved it. Okay, so here's an English translation. The intro is, what is rightness, what is stupidity? I'll show you what they are. I was an honor student being young before I realized I was already grown up, a train of thought like a knife, which I didn't have that with me. But I'm not having enough fun. Something is missing. These troubles are better. These troubles... <laughs> These troubles better are somebody's fault. Okay, I'm just confused today. Wait, so, so that sentence is a little... And I, I think I know what she's saying, but just the sentence alone, the grammar kind of messed with me. But anyways. Well, is this so understanding the latest trends, checking the stock market on my way to work, joining a company with a pure spirit? These are the obvious rules for us workers. Huh? Shut up, shut up, shut the hell up. I'm healthier than you think you are too mediocre to understand me, perhaps. Ah, you are so perfect match to those ordinary melodies of yours. Huh? Shut up, shut up, shut the hell up. I deal with things so differently, so no problem at all. Yeah, I'm an exemplary person, so, so no thanks to actually punching someone. If I'll point my muzzle of words to your head and fire, wouldn't that be so crazy? I can't stop complaining and complaining till you die. My spirit becomes sadistic. I'm hella tired, pour drinks when glasses are empty, take off the skewers so it's easier for everyone to eat, check and order before anyone does, these are the minimum rules for social manner, shut up, shut up, shut the hell up, close your stinking mouth, I can't stand it, I'm the modern outspoken person, I'm fed up with those rehash parody of yours, shut up, shut up, draw an X on your rat, on your fat face, shut up, shut up, shut the hell up, you're so, I'm your so called genius, shut up. I'm healthier than you think. You're too mediocre to understand me, perhaps. Ah, so boring. How many times do I have to listen to those memories of yours? Shut up. I know I'm not a big deal either, but I don't care. No problem at all. Okay, is it just me or is this like scream, let the haters hate? Just simple as that. Whether this is directed towards one person or say a Karen or a Ken, you're trying to break the mold of society. You know, understanding the latest trends, checking the stock market on my way to work, joining a company with a pure spirit. Those are the obvious rules for us workers. Healthier than you think. You're too mediocre to understand me. So you're so perfect. Those are all these people that get after us for the most stupid reasons. Like you're so perfect. Glad, I'm glad your world is so perfect. Not everybody else's is, you know? Those people that are just willing to yell at you for no reason in public over the stupidest stuff. 
whether it is some random outburst in public or maybe somebody that has known you for a little bit and they're trying to change you like haters gonna hate simple as that you can't always you just can't always please everybody it's just never gonna happen it sucks don't get me wrong nobody wants to get yelled at in public nobody wants to get yelled at by anybody period nobody likes negativity life life does suck but you don't want to force it you know you don't want to make somebody be what you want them to be you can't force people to live life the way you do and there's so many people out there that will try to go out of their way they'll play the victim card they'll say i don't do this i don't do that. i don't know why you would say that i do this but they're doing exactly what they fear of doing you know they're, they're doing exactly what they don't want they say that they're not controlling people when they actually are they're literally trying so hard and then playing the victim when they get in trouble you can't demand things from people you can't be entitled to things it just doesn't work that way no matter how hard you want to try the world does not owe you a thing everybody's got problems everybody's got skeletons in their closet i've got a few myself that i'm still dealing with right now we've all got our cross to bear and it's good to have family and friends around you but you know there's just a time and a place to vent about stuff. Don't make everything about you. Don't be selfish. Don't be toxic. Don't be controlling. Don't be demanding. Don't use other people around you just to get what you want or just because you don't feel like doing something or whatever. Don't take advantage of people that actually care about you. Don't even take advantage of strangers. Don't be mean. Don't. The world does not owe you anything. I can't stand people that do that stuff. It's just sad. It's That's all it is. It's just sad. Let's see if there's actually a meaning here. The song is, there's actually a song tell for this, holy crap. The song you see well, by Ado is a critique of a society that values conformity and working hard to, and working hard above all else. The lyrics explore the idea of what it means to be right or wrong and discuss how often it feels like a struggle to be accepted and fit in with the rest of society. The singer expresses his frustration with the situation he is in and calls out people who believe they are better than anyone else. The singer also emphasizes that ultimately there is no problem with being who you are and having your own values, even if they don't match with those of society. The chorus repeats the lyrics of Yusiwa, which can be translated to working hard isn't always the answer. Thus, the song ultimately posits that we should not bother trying to fit in with the norms of society. So I would have been right to begin with crap with the not trying to fit the mold of society, not trying to fit in with the new trends or because I was going to guess that it was all about trying to break the mold of society and not follow all the new trends and just be yourself. But my brain went to, well, you know, it's also it also could just be about haters going to hate. I guess you could kind of say it's a little bit of both. I don't know. I'll shut up from here, though. Thank you, Matt Wall. That was an awesome song. Seriously. <laughs> It's not too often I get into songs like that, but seriously, that was a really, that was a diamond in the rough. That was good. Thank you for that. Hope you had a good birthday, bro. I'm gonna go, I like how that said he. The, the, the description of the song said he, but I know that's a she. You said it she, right? Yeah, her, Let's start listening to her, that's a she. And obviously the animation even showed it as a her, so I don't know why it said he, but whatever. That's Google for you. But anyways, you guys in the comments, you let me know what you think. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so very much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And as always, remember, my name is Jeff. Pef Junkies Unite. And I'll see you guys soon. I'll see you guys in the next one. Love, peace, and chicken grease. You guys have a fantastic day and a fantastic night.